Hello and welcome. Today we are going to work on assembly drawing brace assembly. You should first go to this link. You can use the description part of this video. I attached the link over there. And then when you click the link, you are going to come to this web page. If you log in your account, you just need to click the make a copy. And then, okay. When you make the copy, you have every file in your account, so you can make the necessary changes. So since we are going to work on the drawings, I'm going to click the insert new element, create drawings, and then you should choose the ANSIC millimeter drawing. If you don't see this template here, you can click the show on shape drawing templates and you can scroll down and you can find it out from here. Gonna click OK. Insert view is automatically activated. Instead of Part Studio, we are gonna go to Assemblies and we are gonna get the top assemblies here. And then instead of Front View, we are gonna get the isometric. And the default instead of default, we are gonna get the exploded view. And the view scale will be one to one. Then we are going to place on the drawing template, left click. Next, we are going to insert the bomb table. Make sure the top assembly and the uh, flat end, top to bottom, is activated. And then you are going to just move your cursor, the mouse, to edge and left click you have the bomb table now we are gonna use the colots and we are gonna use them for the each parts here so i'm gonna just click the first part this is number one number two so these numbers based on the bomb table so this is the survival and this is on the list four. Therefore, it automatically gives the four for this part. These red signs are going to be goes off when I click the escape. Okay, now we have all the parts here. Um, next, as you can see on the description part of the first one, it says the pipe. I'm going to change it so I cannot edit from here. Therefore, I'm going to go to document menu, left click and workspace properties. And then I'm going to click here. And I'm going to choose the pipe and left click the pipe. In the description part, I'm going to delete the pipe here and I'm going to change it to boom and save. When I update from the workspace, this pipe will be changed to boom. So let's see. Okay, it is changed. Next. We are going to go to, again, Document Menu, Workspace Properties, and we click here, and we're going to choose Top Assembly. Then for the part number, we are going to click here. The part number will be L6-EX3-ASM01. And for the title two, we are going to write it down, brace assembly. Then we're going to click the save. So when we update from the, this workspace, you will see some changes here. So as you can see, brace assembly goes here. So normally you can click and type it individually, like you can type it by yourself, but it is better if you do from here also, uh, because if you change it from here, 
and you can automatically place it like for the C part that the part number I'm gonna just double click here and then instead of typing so I'm gonna click the insert sheet reference property and I'm gonna click the title too and then I'm gonna click oh sorry not the title two instead of title two it's going to be part number and then I'm gonna click green check mark so as you can see automatically get the uh, title number and we have the uh, the part number we have the brace assembly title also here we have the bomb table and we have all the colors and this is how to complete assembly drawing brace assembly have a wonderful day